My, not my name is Oliver Kahn, and uh, I used to be a goalkeeper. First of all, Ollie is a very laid-back person. But when he was a goalkeeper, I would say he was a little more explosive. If you ran up to Oliver alone, you'd think, better pass fast or shoot fast, because otherwise he'll eat you up. I don't need any of that today. My old goalkeeper attitude. It might sound like I have a split personality, being so over-emotional and loud. I found that I no longer need to pound the table and scream and yell in order to achieve my goals in this world. On the contrary. And these days, who wants to work with someone like that anyway? The Bayern Munich. I was just fascinated with them when I was a boy. It's not like I'm losing sleep at night here, but of course I'm kind of nervous. I've always had to change my objective. Actually, I really wasn't that talented. It was more about just trying to reach the next level that I could achieve. And then I suddenly realized, oh, well, now I might as well maybe go to FC Bayern. Why not? The FC Bayern jersey weighs a little bit more because all those legends are sitting on your shoulders. And somehow you have to manage to shake this burden. That takes a lot of willpower, but the rewards are worth the effort. Ali was obsessed with success, in a good way. Obsessed with work. We've got to keep going, keep going, and we got it! We got it! Depression and burnout, they always go together. I was just exhausted. That was back in the late 90s, yeah. I think if one day you find that you're having trouble walking up the stairs at home, that you can't climb your own stairs anymore without collapsing at the top, falling down exhausted, that's a wake-up call, isn't it? And you see where that can lead you at some point. This higher and higher, further and further, and to top it again and again and still not be satisfied? If you can't properly maintain a balance between tension and relaxation, then that's a message from your body saying, hey, this is it, I can't do this anymore, and that you can't keep doing this forever. But my job now is to look ahead and make sure we continue to be this successful in the future. Because in the end, that's how I'm going to be judged. I really don't need a kick in the ass. I have my goals. I want to play well. I want to help the team. It would also be amazing for me on a personal level if we win this together. I don't really care if people criticize me because I really just like to focus on myself and I'm okay with the pressure. And playing at FC Bayern, that means pressure. It also gives you a boost. You live for games like this. Then when the pressure comes, that's when you really start struggling and you lose confidence in yourself. Then it's even harder to do it on the field and to play well and to free up your mind. Oh man, this Holland guy is just unbelievable today. He's like a machine. I guess we need to call for help. No, I think first we should call for a hairdresser and get this guy a haircut. Sometimes you gotta have fun on the bench. Watching the game with a stone face, that's definitely not the case here at all. With us, it's no different than it'd be in the lower leagues. Guys, go, go, go! That's great! Yes, 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 yes. Now we are in charge, guys. Now it's our game. 
Be sure to wait as long as you can, because if you move too soon, then they'll figure out what you're doing next. Okay, so when I stand still, I'm kind of invisible, right? It's only when I run that they realize where I am. Look, oh, there's something wrong with Jerome. Jerome, twisted his knee. Substitute. Send Javi in. Just put your weight on us. Does this feel right? We are the Derby winners. Two days off, and then we'll see you again on Tuesday. So the best thing as a coach is that feeling when you get the team honed and focused on a common goal. Good job, nice move. The not so great part of it is that, needless to say, it puts you in the spotlight quite a bit. And there are a lot of press conferences and you gotta get used to them. And that required a lot of energy from me, especially in the last few weeks. You really have to think very carefully about what you say. I'll read you my favorite verse. This is Philippians. 413, I can do everything through Christ who gives me power and strength. It's true what they say about Germany. If you work really hard, if you're determined and have perseverance, you'll get a chance. And I got this chance. Yeah, maybe I asked for it. I definitely gave everything for it. There is no guarantee that anything that worked for us in the past will continue to work for us in the future. The new management has to use the AHEAD project as a roadmap to build a successful future for FC Bayern. Of course, there are different views on things. There are people who have been with the club for a long time who I would say act a little bit like they own the club. And there are some there, young blood, who say, hey, we have to do everything differently now. Just as my history shaped me, Alfonso's past had an impact on him. It's not always easy, but that makes him stronger. And I think playing with us, he'll have a sensational career. Before the game, I don't really try to think about too much. You know, you just have to be loose, you have to be free in the mind. Play a game and enjoy football. Okay, guys, concentrate. We keep the zeros on the other side of the scoreboard, okay? Down one man, 4-0 at halftime. <laughs>